Sarah and I met 11 years and 20 days ago on a street corner in Sheffield. He was really handsome and he was in a band. Yes, I met Ruth on a street corner. No, she was not working. Yes, I used the line, I'm in a band. <laughs> no, it did not have any effect. I've got Joe's religious education book from 18 years ago when we were 15. Wanted and reward to spend eternity with me. A trustworthy wife who would, who would want me for the person I am, not to be obsessed with themselves or their looks, but good looking in a natural way, if possible. Cause you're a dream worth having in the night The thought of you, it burns so badly Must have been all the trouble that you put me through and When you come, you're surrounded by the light Take me out like a rogue with rain. I sent him a text saying sorry And asked him if he would give me another chance And we met for a drink that night I was actually supposed to be working that night At a job that I'd not long had I didn't go to work that night, subsequently got sacked <laughs> and saw him from every, every night then on for a year. And the rest is history. To be faithful, caring and not to only enjoy the material things in life and the most important thing to have a good sense of humour. And to be fair, I think you've done well there, mate. Seriously, well done. She, she ticks all the boxes, sure. When I touched your face, yeah, the I was scary, I felt so alive in an avalanche buried on the other side. You let it slip. I just want to tell you, I'm so incredibly proud of you, as I've said. You're a wonderful sister, an amazing auntie, and I know you're going to make a great wife too. You, it burns so badly. The things that he now loves about me, it's just my overall sense of calm and serenity. <laughs> It also goes hand in hand with being extremely neat and tidy, as well as being a great timekeeper. But I think the thing that he loves most of all is my unparalleled ability to slip Titanic quotes into any conversation, in any situation. I've lived what seems to be three lives, maybe. Um, just really different things, different paths, and I've had some really good uh, teachers along the way. But I've uh, never learned more about love, loss, compassion, and strength than from Ruth and Tom. Always remember, near, far, wherever you are, I believe that my heart will go on. I'm sorry, I've got to say this bit, but apparently Joe's a bit of a stud. On their first proper night together, he had other girls knocking on the door. Not to mention his girlfriend at the time called Rhea, or as Ruth likes to call her, Diarrhea. <laughs> I'd like to say a massive thank you to the bridesmaids who look absolutely stunning and your beauty inside and out has really, really made me realise how ugly my friends are. I mean, hideous. What I can say is I know, Ruth, you, what you found in Joe is what Mum found in Dad. You're soulmates, and as everyone was witness today, it's obvious you're going to have a wonderful life together. To Mr and Mrs Morag!